Hi, everybody. Welcome to the Progressive Air Workshop. Joining me again, Tom Wilcox. How are you? How are you doing, John? Thanks for being here. Glad to be here. Today, we're going to walk through the setup of your brand new core thermostat system. This is a smart thermostat. Uh, why don't we go ahead and fire that up? Mm. All right, Tom. So we've got our core thermostat fired up. Tell us what we're looking at here. Uh, right now, what we're looking at is the, the number 75 on there. That's the actual temperature in your house. Okay. And directly beneath that is actually the humidity. Excellent. Humidity level in your house. Now, what else do I need to set up for this to be up and running at my home? Okay, right here you have your mode button. Basically what that is, is that's how you turn it to cool. All right, we'll set it to cool. Okay. All right, and then uh, this is how you adjust your temperature. And so the uh, temperature in the blue box is what uh, the desired temperature is? That is correct. Okay. And then uh, over here is how we would set up uh, the uh, the schedule, okay, where we can actually go here and we can we can press it on on home. And these are presets. These are presets that okay. that you set up under right under here, all right, under your temperature profiles. All right. Okay. And so when it comes to scheduling, I can schedule these by day of the week, time of the day. Correct, and okay. and and up to uh, four different periods. Right here, this would be your wake time, okay? It's telling you that you're gonna wake wake up. You want it to be 78 degrees uh, when you wake up, or you can adjust it to uh, 76. And then you That's press fine. save, and as you can see, all right, it, it has your heat and your, your cool temperature, so it's an auto changeover. Oh, the, excellent. For right. the time of the year when and with being in Florida that you need air conditioning on in the daytime and then it gets gets cold at night, it'll automatically change for you. So in the winter, I don't have to reprogram it? I don't, do not have to reprogram That's it. That's excellent. Okay. Now in the menu, um, it, it seemed like there's uh, quite a bit of options there. What are some of the other features that we can implement? Okay. This is your weather. That, that you have, which which comes in handy for, you know, if you're if if you're planning on, you know, sending the kids to school, sure. you can you can even look at your thermostat and it'll tell you, oh, it looks like it's going to be raining uh, later on during the day. Or you can adjust your temperature accordingly. That is correct. Is uh, 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 also the uh, you can go in say all of a sudden you want to the wife comes home doesn't doesn't like the temperature you can just do one simple where you can edit, edit the different schedules and different times. Right, so for specific times when you know that you're going to be home or be away from home. Be away from home, okay, and up here it has a day of the week and you can even add more, more periods if you want to add another home, you can actually add another home in there and, and then, it, then it will keep on adding those. Excellent is the the other uh, feature that it has here you see here is vacation okay so you can actually create a vacation schedule so you know you don't want your your air conditioner running the same as when you're home you want right. to maybe raise the temperature up a little bit even though you can control it from anywhere uh, you know you may be flying and not have access so, so i can tell it when i'm leaving and when i'm coming back when you're coming back Fantastic. Just, just by setting up you know what time uh, day year and then hit next and then you do your temperature well when then, people travel things get a little hectic a little crazy and so it's one less thing to worry about that is that is correct is uh, all right now you got an alerts feature there now what does that do uh, the 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 alerts feature uh, let's see let's see if we have anything on the inbox here now basically the the alert feature is it's basically telling me that i had a cooling problem on on this day, on August 30th at 126. Okay, and then so that's a red flag for me to call Progressive Air, have them come out and look at my unit. And and because we're the contractor on record for this, mm -hmm. and if you're tied to Wi-Fi, it'll also send us an email saying that hey, you have a problem, so we oh, can actually excellent. we can reach out to you and say hey, uh, I got an alert that your system isn't cooling sure. uh, correctly. Either we can send you an email, or you know we can we can give you a courtesy phone call which is a handy feature to have. Absolutely. And then this is just a normal screen mm -hmm. uh, that we have. I mean, as long as you don't see a red line through that, you have a good Wi-Fi connection. And again, that's one of the most important things is making sure your Wi-Fi is connected. 
Tom, thank you so much for walking us through the core smart home thermostat system. Glad to do it. If you have any questions or want more information on one of these smart home thermostat systems, visit ProgressiveAirSystems.com.